The first part of the glory has left us too stunned to speak, but did you know that the cast had to go through some pretty intense transformations to nail their roles? Song Hye Kyo, the star of the show who plays the role of the damaged Dong Eun, had to really mentally prepare herself to play this role well. The goal was to portray a heartbroken woman who's fierce and pretty inspiring at the same time. When Hye Kyo was asked about her character, she explains that she believes Dong Eun is in the need of some affection and understanding. She added, She's been through a lot. Moon Dong Eun has a scarred heart, and I want want to portray her that way. And there was one thing that Hekyo wanted to make especially clear. She didn't want Dong Eun to appear pitiful or helpless because of her past. Instead, she strived to make her look as vengeful as possible, letting viewers know that revenge is the only thing on her mind. In order to make Dong Eun appear as stoic as possible, Hekyo had to work a lot on her speech. She couldn't speak as she normally would, instead she paid extra attention to her tone and dialect and made sure it fitted Dong Eun's personality. The writer of the drama Gi Moon Suk revealed that Hekyo also had to constantly change her expression to match Dong Eun's feelings. At the end, this was definitely the icing on the cake and perfected her character. She even expressed that she thinks that this is Hekyo's best role yet. Physically, Hekyo went through quite the transformation as well. We've all seen how she rocked her short black hair. Another very important change to her appearance is that she's covered in scars in the show. These are caused by a straightening iron and they serve as a reminder of her horrible past. In the show, Dong Eun reveals her scars to Yo Jong, immediately convincing him to go along with her plan because of how heartbreaking it is. This scene was a perfect example of how well Hekyo's preparation paid off. The haunted look in her eyes excellently delivered how painful this moment must have been for Dong Eun. We obviously get to see a glimpse of Hekyo's body, but unfortunately, netizens haven't been all too nice with their comments lately. Quite a few people have body shamed Hekyo online by saying that she looks too short and leaving degrading comments about her figure. They even went as far as comparing her body to that of an elementary school student. Hekyo's family base wasn't having any of this and quickly came to her defense by explaining that her character is traumatized and exhausted, so she's supposed to look that way in the show. It's true that Hekyo lost weight for her role in order to really nail every aspect of Dol Moon's character. Hekyo revealed that she really wanted the scene in which she reveals her scars to be included, but Eunsook warned her that it would mean that she would have to lose weight. Hekyo took on the challenge and explained in an interview that her diet mainly consisted of cognac rice. She only had two months to transform her body in a way that would make her look completely exhausted in the show. Eunsook felt so moved by this transformation and said, I was so grateful for her efforts and also felt bad, so it really made me tear up when I saw the completed scene. Hekyo reacted to her own transformation and expressed that looking pretty in the show wasn't a priority of hers at all. She explained that it would be very out of character for Dong Eun to take care of her appearance since she doesn't have the time nor the energy to do that. Referring to the scene where she undresses, Hekyo said, especially in this scene, as Miss Gi mentioned, I wanted the viewers to feel bad for her when they see her skinny body instead of something pretty. It's safe to say that she definitely made us feel sad every time we saw her covered in scars. Hekyo wasn't the only cast member that went through a crazy physical transformation because Jong Song Il shocked the world with the pictures he shared on his Instagram. Who would have thought that Yeon Jin's husband looks like that? His transformation is currently the hottest topic online, and what really stunned the viewers is that he managed to make his body look like this in the span of only eight weeks. The craziest part is that Song didn't even take any supplements, and he also didn't follow a specific program with a personal trainer. It was his own hard work that brought him these results. He revealed that he would train for two to three hours every day for eight weeks straight. His intense training schedule definitely matches his intense personality in the drama. Especially in scenes with Hekyo, the tension is through the roof. Who knows, perhaps we'll get to show off his body in the second part of the drama. Someone who really had to do her best to get in character is Shin Ye Eun, who plays the younger version of Yeon Jin. It isn't easy to play the perfect villain in any show, but Ye Eun pulled it off flawlessly. But of course, this took some effort. She had to completely change her appearance and behavior to fit that of a juvenile delinquent. In other words, she had to basically transform into a cruel person for this role. She had to change her posture and behavior to perfectly mimic a mean girl in school. Even the tone of her voice and her expression changed to make her appear more unhinged. Aside from the fact that she literally harmed Dong Eun, fans believe that she did a great job at showing questionable behavior that fit her character in other settings as well. In one of the scenes, Yeon Jin is at church looking rather unserious. People believe that she didn't shy away from filming the scene brawless to show just how reckless Yeon Jin's character really is. In such a conservative setting, going brawless can be seen as a provocative sign, and that seems to be very in line with Ye Eun's character. Jong Ji Seo, the actress that plays the younger version, 
version of Dong Eun also did an outstanding job and had to go through quite a lot of makeup sessions after all of Yeonjin's tormenting. Lim ji had to take her transformation into an evil schoolgirl to the extremes. In an interview with Esquire Korea, she revealed that she even had to get violent on set to make her scenes look as realistic as possible, which is something that doesn't match her real-life personality at all. Given that it was her first role playing a villain, she was willing to do whatever it takes to put out something realistic. In one of the scenes, Yeonjin gives dong a slap. ji revealed that she and Hekyo were really slapping each other until their faces got swollen so that they could get the perfect shot. She said, The director asked me to hit her properly at once, so I tried to slap her hard in order not to make cuts. Another cast member that really shocked the audience with her transformation is Cha Ju Yong, who plays the role of Hedong. In the drama, Hedong is known to be ashamed of her poor background and yearns for all the luxurious things in life. Throughout the series, she appears to be a strong follower that seems to have no direction of her own. Ju Yong's real life appearance is very contrasting compared to her character in The Glory. She has this soft, calm look to her, but in the show, that completely changes. Hedong is seen wearing more seductive outfits to appear more appealing, meanwhile in real life, she looks a lot more youthful. Hedong gives off the impression that she isn't that bright because she seems blinded by her desire to belong with the elites. This might be why the audience was shocked to find out that Ju Yong actually has an excellent academic background in real life. Recently, a post about her academic background became a hot topic within an online community. People were surprised to see that she graduated in business administration from the University of Utah, which is one of the best research universities in the United States. Netizens were so amazed by this that someone even commented, oh my, stewardess Hedong is so smart in real life. Her portrayal of Hedong seems to have people believing that she's not so bright at all, which just proves that she's a great actress. Kim Hyoda is someone who transforms for every single one of her roles. If you compare her performance in Bad and Crazy to her performance in The Glory, you wouldn't even believe that it's the same person. In the series, she plays the role of Sada, an artsy girl with a bit of a problem with substances. This problem is mainly reflected in the way her eyes look because Hyoda has pretty red eyes in the drama. If you compare Hyoda's look in the show to her current look, you wouldn't recognize her. At the moment, she's rocking a blonde pixie cut and doesn't look like Sada at all. This just shows what a simple hair change can do to a person. Last but not least, fans were at a loss for words when they saw Imu Sang's transformation in the show. He plays the role of the guy who took the life of Yeodong's father, and let's just say he's a bit unwell. Although Mu Sang only made a cameo, he made a huge impact on fans because they're used to his roles as a gentle and nice middle-aged man. In The Glory, he did a total 180 and played the role of a psychopath, which even made a fan comment, is that Imu Sang I know? That was all on the transformations of the cast of The Glory. Let us know your thoughts. Thanks for watching. Bye!